I tell you Checking what, man, his sentence. relentless Alonzo pursuit Morning. and attacking of the goal oh. and his opponent is really something to watch. And let's get this update now from Doris Burke, who's across the way on the sideline. Hi, guys. Over that break, I was able to catch the message Brad Stevens was giving to his team. He said to them, the lead we've got now is nice, but I want to make it even nicer. This is when we put the hammer down. It doesn't look like he's ready to back off just yet, guys. And for Westbrook, uh, he had some high praise. Allen Iverson said he's a huge fan of Westbrook and sees so much of himself in him mostly due to how they play with heart. I'll tell you the other thing, Allen Iverson I always felt was the most intimidating small guard in the history of the league. Russell Westbrook rapidly trying to claim that honor. Kicks it out to Harden. There's Westbrook. He clangs that one off the back iron and down it falls. Westbrook's got five points now this quarter. They can take their time on this possession. You know, guys, that wouldn't be a bad idea. I mean, it gives themselves a little break, too. Catch their breath. You're yep. right. You know, I, I was thinking back to that Iverson quote on Westbrook. I mean, they play with that same fire. The styles in which they play are different, but, but you can see the intensity is the same between them. It just hasn't been a very good day for him, guys. They need him to start burying some of those. Irving kicks to morning. Shoots from 12, and he hits the jumper for two. Morning's got 14 points now in the second half. And this is what they wanted. I mean, to announce their presence in this matchup with authority. Very decisive. It can definitely be considered a statement win for Boston. Tonight, they did a great job of getting everyone involved. They had the good passing, and that led to some open shots. Yeah, it's a fun way to play, and it's fun to watch, too. And so checking out their record tonight, that'll mark win number 32 overall. And with the win approaching, they'll take the first game here of two that they'll play again. Now for Minnesota, Marcus Gasol has checked in for Yao. Baca comes in for LaMarcus Aldridge. Jerome Kersey's checked in for James. And Ginobili in for lights out. Manu Ginobili. 105 left in the fourth Boston quarter. Foul, you know, guys, coaching in the right. NBA is not for the faint of heart. Very little job security. I mean, in I essence, you get hired days. to be fired. It, it, let's face it, it's hard to make a bunch That's of millionaires do what you tell them to when they might be around longer than you will. And speaking of coaching, sometimes you'll hear that the coach lost the team. Uh, when that happens, is, is that it, Clark? I mean, what's your read on that? You know, I don't quite buy that. I think it's really rare. Winning can cover up a lot of things, and ultimately, it does come down to that. Being able to smooth out the team is the best elixir for that. I, I don't want to say they're trying to run up the score here, but they do keep adding to the lead. Well, I know you don't want to say it, but I will, partner. I mean, they're trying to run the score up here. Plain and simple. They're trying to throw salt all in that wound. He's so tough to guard. He can fake you one way and then just spin right by you. Morning, a screen on Westbrook. Here's Irving. And another basket for Boston. And this is going to be a fantastic result for them. No win on the road comes easy. Not in the NBA, they don't. And trust me, they're going to take a little extra pleasure in this win, having silenced an entire building of hostile fans. And it's Westbrook missing. And here is Irving. He dishes it to Morning. Shoots from 14, and it's wide right. It's off the rim. And there's the call on Kyrie Irving. The free throw drops for Russell Westbrook. Russell Westbrook. And Russell Westbrook drops a vote. In and adding salt to the wound. Irving for three. Count it. And so it's Boston easily grabbing this one. This crowd was stunned by the manner in which their team was dismantled. You know what? Shocking. I don't care what the matchup is. You never expect a road team to come in 